All right, quiet on set. Jesus. What's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of Los Davlitos, and today we're going to talk about lighting because I'm in the dark. So, the first thing we want to do is turn on our key light. And before you turn on a bright light, you always want to say striking. So what do you say, Manny? Striking. All right, we got our key light on. So, I just want to talk about uh, Mr. Davalos, a.k.a. Los Davalitos. He's a really good guy, and uh, he, he's uh, taught me a lot of things in life. Uh, one of them is to make sure that uh, you yell striking during a um, lighting session. Um, because you just, you don't want to blind your actor. Alright, so we are going to be using a Zeiss lens here. It's going to be the Macro Planar Zeiss Lens 50mm. We're going to put this onto a C100 and we'll talk about the settings after that. Okay guys, uh, welcome to Los Davalitos. So today we're just going to be talking about some lighting. Uh, so as you can see, this is very intense lighting in my face right now. So all we're going to do is uh, go ahead and put this diffuser on me. and. Um, Yeah, that's, that's, that's a little bit better. All right, our settings for what we're filming today, our temperature is going to be 3200. We're gonna take the iris all the way down to 2.0 because that's the lowest it can go so we can get the really shallow depth of field. And then our ISO, we're probably going to bring down to 850, but we're gonna be changing that throughout just based on the lighting that we have. Okay, now when you're setting up your key light, the most important thing is you wanna get it at an angle that is at the opposite side of the camera so that you can enhance shadows because when you are trying to light in a cinematic way you want to look for shadows so that you can create depth. You got re your reflector here you've got the silver the silver and gold side and then you got the, the silver side and what we're going to do is we're going to take it out and we are going to just use the diffusion and we're going to put it in front of this RE650 so that we can try to get a nice soft light on our subject Manny here because he has to leave. So we've narrowed down the light, we've got a nice soft light but we still have some shadows on, this other, on the other side of Manny's face so we're going to bring in another reflector. All right, bring it over just a little bit more so we can bounce some more. So like kind of like, see where the light is hitting? Right there you want to bring it in. Okay. All right. So you can get another C-stand here and set it up so that it's right there. Sometimes it works better to have a C-stand because the person that's holding it can sometimes move a little bit and it might affect the light. So if you look at him, he's kind of moving a little bit, um, but that's okay. Uh, we're not going for a blockbuster here. Um, the last thing that I want to add on here is a backlight because you don't have you, the light behind is there's not very much light coming in from behind. So what I would do, um, is either put a lamp back there or put something back there. In this case, we might just get um, might just get a hair light and see what happens. Alec, what do I need to do right now to make this more entertaining for you? You want me to dance? No, I just want you to. Have you seen Darius before? Hey, say something. Say something. Like, no, just, just say something. Okay, right now, plug in the light. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I love that. I'm not a clown, okay? I'm never doing this with you guys ever again. Ha! Okay, so what's really important is you buy lights that don't short. So um, as you as you can see here, I taped this with electrical tape, but really I just need to buy a new light. Just stay. Okay, so if you slam it hard enough, it'll stay on. That's stupid. That's not funny. That's, but that's, that's what's going to be That's what people want to see. Well, okay. No one wants to see that. All right. Old, right. Just you. Old white people may not. But, <laughs> but, but, but the younger <laughs> indie <laughs> filmmakers who are dumb and stupid, they're going to like it. So, okay. So we got our look here. We've got some people walking around in the background. Um, but we've got our look going on. Um, I've got a hair light. It's a little blue. Um, but you know what? If you don't like that, um, I really don't care. Yeah, okay, can I show you what you guys are doing? That's <laughs> kind of okay, okay. He does that. He just does it all the time. I'm, I'm going to come to your I'm, videos and I'm be like this the whole time. <laughs> I'm reacting. That wasn't even in the shop. Oh my god. Dude, I'm reacting. 
All right, so I'm never doing one of these videos with all of my students in the room ever again. Get out of the shot. All right, so you guys are probably wondering what uh, my tips are for lighting. Um, mine would be just to uh, make sure the lighting's super intense on your face um, and make sure that you have like five lights on at the same time. So you have one on your side, one to your diagonal, one right in front of you, other to your diagonal, and another one. But um, Dovlis doesn't completely agree with that one. <laughs>